All right, guys, let's see how good she is at pallet crawling. <laughs> to it. What's up guys? It's Eric back out here with the Arma Outcast 8S EXB. I'm going to give her another quick blast. Uh, the made run on this truck went outstanding. Had a load of fun. Uh, no major brakes on the truck. Just a bent uh, front tower to tower brace up there. But I was able to fix that. No problem. Uh, the shocks held up. Uh, no broken arms. No broken links. Uh, the chassis on the truck uh, held up as far as I could tell. I didn't put a ruler to it yet, but as far as I could see, there's there's no uh, no bend to it. Still running the uh, Hobby Wing 1100 KV in it, geared 3039. Uh, in my opinion, it's a little bit tall. I got a little bit of cogging on the bottom end, and she did run a little bit hot on the on the, uh, on the maiden bash. Uh, so I do have a uh, an 850 KV 5692. I'm gonna be putting in it. I just haven't had time to do it and I solder up all the bullets and stuff. So I'm gonna try that out on the next run. I'm just, I'm just cringing and get out and get for another quick uh, blast while we got some nice weather. There's a lot more rain coming in soon, so. All right, guys, we'll see what's up. Oh man, that was a hard hit. She's still trucking, it looks like. All right, guys, let's see how good she is at pallet crawling. <laughs> Oh, that was a hard slap. Looks like I'm about to lose another tire. I had one foam go in the back earlier. Put a spare on it. <laughs> that was kind of a harsh landing. And it blew out the tire to it the last second. Here's one of the foams. 
Yeah, she lives. All right, guys, I just threw on a set of the Duratrax uh, six-pack uh, X tires, belted tires, because I just blew another tire. This is the third backflip that I've blown uh, since I've had the truck. Um, I had to, to re-glue it one time already, and it just uh, blew the foam clean out of it on that, uh, or part of it on that last uh, jump. <laughs> and also bent this uh, drive shaft right here because it landed kind of sideways. So I fixed that real quick. She's definitely going to be getting the M2C drive shaft uh, a treatment as soon as I get home. But I'm going to run it for a second, run the rest of this pack out with these uh, six packs, and uh, see what's up. Hey guys, she's way more stable with the belt of tires. Guys, that's gonna be it. Just wanted to run the rest of that pack. <laughs> yeah, these dirt tracks uh, tires, uh, belted tires, definitely hook up a lot better, and uh, are, and they're a lot more stable for sure, especially in the street on these high-speed uh, ramp launches. So, uh, but overall, I'm just astounded at how the truck has held up. I still haven't broken anything on the truck. I just bent the drive shaft and uh, that tower brace and that first bash. Um, I have blown a, a few of the tires. <laughs> Again, that's why I put on these belted tires. Uh, those, those stock tires just don't hold up when you got all this huge power. But um, anyway, inside the truck looks good. I didn't bend the top brace this time. All the uh, brace rod ends are intact. Still got the M2C brace right there, rod end. So we'll check the chassis real quick. She looks, uh, she looks pretty straight from what I can tell. Again, you have to put a ruler to it to get accurate, but nothing uh, major for sure. All right, we'll take a quick look at the shocks too. From what I can tell, they're still straight. The shock shafts are still straight still butter smooth still haven't broken a rod end i'm sure in the winter time you know there may be issues with the rod ends simply because the plastic is getting cold uh, so that's when the m2c uh, shock shafts and rod ends would come in handy for sure the front ones still look good still butter smooth no bends no breaks so big shout out to uh, irma for uh for beefing this sucker up and having another option in the exp line it's a lot of fun and uh, next time i'm probably going to switch the motor to the hobby star uh, 850 kv now we'll give that a try all right, guys, until next time, RC Dude 81. Peace out.